Singers Demi Lovato and Nick Jonas have been through a lot together. Both former TV stars grew up in the public eye, and despite numerous career changes, health troubles, and romances, they've managed to remain tight over the years. But their friendship hasn't always been smooth sailing. Here's the untold truth of Demi Lovato and Nick Jonas's friendship. Fast Times at Disney High Demi Lovato and Nick Jonas both got their first big breaks on Disney Channel. Starting in 2007, Lovato starred in a series of shorts called As the Bell Rings. Sorry, Toe Jam, I don't know if you're ever gonna get that date. Oh, I'm getting that date. Told you it was a date. <laughs> but Lovato really made a name for herself, starring as Mitchie Torres in the 2008 Disney Channel movie's Camp Rock, which was Nick Jonas's first major TV hit, too. So, uh, does your voice sound better over here? Why don't we get him one of these things and you can tell me?" Lovato went on to star in several other Disney projects, including Sunny with a Chance and Princess Protection Program. Meanwhile, Nick Jonas starred in the scripted series Jonas. And in 2010, Nick reprised his Camp Rock role in Camp Rock 2, The Final Jam, alongside Lovato and his brother Joe. Lovato told People in 2016, "...we've all watched each other evolve and grow up, and we've been able to be there for one another." Demi dated Nick's brother Joe while playing each other's love interest in Camp Rock, Demi Lovato started dating Nick Jonas's brother Joe. We had our first kiss on camera. In her documentary Simply Complicated, Lovato even remembers the exact instant she realized she had feelings for Joe. This moment, I fear freaking fell in love with him. This moment right here. In real life. And in real life. life. Okay, types. You're a good actress, too, actually. Thanks, I wasn't acting much. Although they continued working together, the romantic relationship ended after a month or two. Shame. You were lying all summer. Yes, but I... You know, I'm so used to people pretending around me. The breakup put Nick in an awkward position. Joe and Demi's relationship had become really complicated, so I was playing the bridge. They're super close. Demi Lovato and Nick Jonas have spent a lot of time together. In fact, they even went on a joint tour in the summer of 2016. We're best friends, I promise. In fact, Nick told Billboard that Lovato is one of the very first people he reaches out to when something major happens in his life. And Lovato has always felt strongly about Nick, too. What people don't know about like Nick is that he's so extremely intelligent that um, he's like one of the only few people that I can like sit down and have like a really deep conversation with. Could they possibly get any closer? Well. Maybe. You dated Selena Gomez. Yeah. yeah. But you two never. No. Nope. No. Really? Does Demi love Nick? At one point in their friendship, Demi Lovato may have wanted to take things to the next level with Nick Jonas. When she released the 2017 track Ruin the Friendship, a lot of people thought the song was about Nick. The song is about wanting to get romantic with a longtime friend. And some lyrics certainly stand out, particularly, put down your cigar and pick me up, and play me your guitar, that song I love. Adding fuel to the fire, Lovato admitted on Ellen that the song is about a fellow musician in her life. Hmm. Nick wanted to save Demi. Back in her early Disney Channel days, Lovato started abusing drugs. Nick Jonas tried keeping her in check and thought he was being a good influence on her. Selfishly, maybe I was like, I'm helping her back into you know, coming back to being the Demi that we all know and love. She's not gonna do anything crazy, it's gonna be fine. And then this episode happened. He's referring to the time Lovato punched a backup dancer in the face during the Camp Rock 2 tour. Lovato reportedly threw the punch because the dancer had exposed her Adderall use. At the age of 18, Lovato checked into rehab for the first time and was diagnosed with bipolar disorder. Jonas prays for Lovato. Tragedy struck on July 24, 2018, when Demi Lovato was rushed to the hospital following a suspected heroin overdose. Nick Jonas was one of the first celebrities to voice concern for his friend after the story made headlines. He tweeted, "...like all of you, I am reeling at the news about Demi. All of us love her and need to pray for her to get well. She is a fighter." 